few days. Hey folks, we're talking about the X-Grip, which is a great piece of kit. And I did a review on this with the m and a couple of months ago. What the uh, grip allows you to do is take a full-size magazine. In this case, this is a m and magazine for the uh, one of the standard m and models that I own. This is a 15, excuse me, a 17 round mag. And it allows you to create a grip with this piece of plastic that slides over the magazine itself. And what that allows you to do is to create a full frame or full size frame handgun because when inserted into the magazine, we have unloaded guns here. Uh, when inserted to the magazine, it allows that frame to basically become a full size handgun, that magazine to make the difference in the frame. So what you do is you can take a compact handgun like this, especially one that's maybe great for concealed carry, in this case our M&P9C, and that's the normal configuration. Now, I can still use this with a traditional magazine without that space, so I can do that. And that certainly works, and it, you know, it shoots okay. However, what I've found is that when you're shooting with the full size frame, it, it feels like a traditional full-size gun and really allows you to get that nice grip on the gun so you really really got a good fighting uh, grip on the gun and one that allows you to make good hits. So just recently last week I picked up the uh, X grip for the Glock 26. The Glock 26 has been one of my favorite carry guns for years and years and years uh, due to its size and its uh, reliability able to get good hits, just feeds and functions uh, any, you know, fantastically uh, and really think think the world of, of the Glocks as I do also with the uh, M&P series. So if we look at our Glock, what we have with a traditional type setup here is we have a magazine that fits, and in this case I put a, a, an extension on it. So that gives me somewhat of a good grip on the gun. Certainly I practice with this a lot and very comfortable with it. You can also use a full-size magazine, as you can with the m and PC, which hangs out like this. Now, what I've found is when you shoot with this type of thing, you get some magazine movement, and sometimes your skin sort of gets caught right up in there. Um, and it's not a big deal, obviously, if you're using the gun for self-defense, you could care less about that. But if you're practicing, what the X-Grip allows you to do is it allows you to get that grip. And now I feel like I have a full-size handgun with, you know, obviously short sight radius and uh, a short um, frame up here, but the actual frame of the gun here in terms of its grip is extremely comfortable. So what we're going to do now is we're going to go out and we're going to shoot the uh, X-Grip on the Glock 26. And the process with that is we'll shoot some regular magazines, you know, magazines that it came with, so that and then we'll shoot it with this. My experience when I shot the M and PC with the X grip was that it made a substantial difference in the way in which I was able to manage the gun and manage the recoil. Again, nine millimeters is not a big deal, but the faster that you can get good, accurate hits uh, on target, uh, the better it is. So we're going to go shoot our Glock 26. This has uh, been around for a long time. I'm going to take it out to the range now, use the X grip, and then just give you some impressions on this little bit of gear. So, let's stop talking, head out to the range. Okay, folks, we're out here. We're going to be testing the Glock 26 with the X grip extension uh, and see how that works. To start with, we're just going to use the Glock, the 10 round magazine that came with the gun. And in this case, what I've done is I've added that small bit of uh, angle to the bottom. So we're going to go ahead and shoot it. Sorry for all the wind. It's a cold, windy day here in New Hampshire. So we're going to go ahead and shoot it with the conventional setup that you just saw. Glock 26, what a good gun. The next thing we're going to do is use the 
X grip that I just put on this Glock 17 mag. So I've got a full size Glock 17 mag using with the Glock 26. And what you see is you've got a flush fit here that gives me a full size grip with the purchase of the gun. So same thing, we're going to do the same thing, just fire a few times. And from my perspective shooting the gun, it's really easy. I mean, it's just, it feels good, right on point, right on target, not a problem. It also helps mitigate the recoil a little bit because you have more to hold on to as you're shooting the gun here. You've got quite a bit of, of space. It's almost, you know, like, uh, like shooting a Glock 17 because you've got the full length there on the grip. So that's what that looks like. Giving, giving us the feel of a full-size gun in a small package in the Glock 26. So I can tell you, with the full-size grip, the X grip here, I've got a better control of the gun. Again, 9mm, not significant recoil, but having that additional grip space makes a big difference on a small gun. So, in summary, bottom line, I think this is a good option if you want to practice with your Glock 26 but have a little bit more of a grip to hold on to the gun with. I want to thank you all for watching. If you like this video or any of the other videos, please click the little thumbs up box at the bottom left side of the screen. Please subscribe and tell your friends and family about the channel. Invite them to join us. Thanks, and as always, stay safe.